Welcome back to the temple, messenger. Wonderful. Mara, we also perform wedding ceremonies for all the loving couples in Skyrim. Yes, if you were ready, of course. Are you familiar with how marriage works in Skyrim? Typically, love in Skyrim is as earnest as the people who live here. Life is hard and short, so there's little room for long courtship. A person who is looking for a spouse simply wears an amulet of Mara about the neck, showing they are available. When another person shows interest and the two agree to be together, one of them comes to the temple and we arrange a ceremony. Here you are. Now, remember, people in Skyrim respond to deeds. You will find more people interested in your love if you help them. Good luck. Mara bless you. May you return to her benevolence and safety. Isn't the slayer of the Glen Moral Witches. Ah, and even if you don't, you're still welcome. I visited the meaderies of Riften once as a lad. Oh, wish I had their skill. Yes, I've wandered a bit, but I always come back to Kynes Grove. My clan was one of the first to settle here. Legend says that my forefather, Lena, discovered the mines after he stumbled into a dark cave to relieve himself. Of course, there's another story of Lena losing the family shield in a different cave. So it depends on who you believe. According to my grandfather, at least, he swore that version of the legend was true. Even found the cave old Lena stumbled into. Hey, if you find it, I could show you some of the clan's favorite fighting moves. They're all shield techniques.
Working our mine is dangerous work, but Dravnia keeps it going. Well, Dravnia and the promise of more meat. My clan's shield. So Lena really did stumble into that cave, and was eaten by monsters. In honor of his memory, let me show you a few shield techniques. And tell me if you're leaving town. Be good to travel again. I am. I'd be glad to stand by your side until the divines together. See? Welcome back. You wish to be married? Your wedding will be held tomorrow, from dawn until dusk. Don't be late. You don't want to miss your own wedding. bride now. Let's begin the ceremony. It was Mara that first gave birth to all of creation and pledged to watch over us as her children. It is from us that we first learned to love one another. It is from this love that we learned that a life lived alone is no life at all. We gather here today under Mara's loving gaze to bear witness to the union of two souls in eternal companionship. May they journey forth together in this life and in the next, in prosperity and poverty and in joy and hardship. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? I do, now and forever. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? Under the authority of Mara, the divine of love, I declare this couple to be wed. I present the two of you with these matching rings, blessed by Mara's divine grace. May they protect each of you in your new life together. I guess we have our entire lives together now. Where should we live? You could stay with me. Then I'll see you at home. Congratulations on your wedding. I'm so happy... I've never seen you before. Leave me alone. 